Have you ever wondered what the difference is between success and failure? Let me tell you one of the keys that I've learned. It's consistency. It's what you're prepared to do over and over and over again that cumulatively makes the difference. They may not always be the big things in a lot of cases. It can also be the small things too. That is true in business, in life and in sport. Have you ever wondered what sets sportsmen and sportswomen apart from their peers? It's not just skill, although that is an important element. It's also consistency. It's what they are prepared to do over and over and over that others are not prepared to do. It's doing the difficult because they know what they want and what it takes and they do it over and over again. Repetition consistently. I know this because I've played a lot of sport in my life and I still play competitive sport today and skill is important. However, skill is enhanced by consistency. Consistency of doing, of playing, of training, of learning, of adjusting and readjusting or testing and trying and getting the right knowledge. There is little value in consistency if you're doing the things incorrectly or doing them wrong. Success in business is no different. What are you doing consistently over and over and over again? What adjustments have you made and what do you need to make? What have you learned? What are you not doing that you should be doing over and over again? Don't forget that sometimes you can't see what you're not looking for. So who's providing you with your unbiased eyes? So here are three keys to consistency. Number one, it needs to be a habit, part of who you are. Number two, be clear on why you are doing the activity or the task and what the outcome is. And number three, measure the changes and improvement and continue to adjust. If you are not getting the results you want, it could be because you are not doing what needs to be done consistently. I'm Robert Bonifacio, challenging you to make consistency part of who you are going forward.